Hey friends, this is Wayne Brown over at the Ram Man Inc. Hey, it's uh Saturday, June 30th, 2018. We just got done putting these locking hubs on this 3500. This is a 2006. Pretty doggone nice shape, huh? For 2006, I mean, shoot, doggone, he's taking pretty good care of it. So, there's our locking hubs, and as you can see, well, we got the beauty ring off right now. So, people are always asking us all the time, do they stick out? Do they stick out? Well, hell no, they don't stick out. They're flush. Either that or recessed. It's like on this dually right here. I mean, you can put the hubcap back on. You just put the hubcap back on. See right here, we're in free mode. So now he's got him a two-wheel drive truck. You know, better acceleration, better gas mileage, getting burning up those hubs up front, bearings, greasable on the vehicle, accelerates faster, frees up about 35 horsepower. Jesus Christ, hell, you can't go wrong. Anybody that doesn't have a locking hubs on a full-wheel drive is, well, Getting the short end of the stick, saying the least. I mean, folks, all the way up until the late 80s, every single four-wheel drive made on the planet had locking hubs because every engineer and anybody with any common sense knew it was stupid to drive around with that front axle engaged all the time. But uh, when they come out with the unit bearings in the late 80s and the 90s, see, Chevrolet and Dodge and everybody else, they said, whoop, we're not going to redesign it because it's going to cost about $20 and we're going to have to spend some money. So we're going we're gonna to push that bad design over to the consumer. They call it the end user. And we're just going to give them a good screwing and let things stand how they stand. So there you go. There's that side. And there's the passenger side with the cap on there. Golly jeepers. Hey, if you ain't got locking hubs on your full wheel drive, Dodge, Chevrolet, Jeep, or Toyota, man, get with the program. Get with what's right. Hey, happy trucking. God bless you. God bless America. The Ram Man Inc. Out.